let's talk about the arrest. Let's come before uh, 2022. Uh, let's go to 2012. I'm a controversial figure in the city. I fought judges, police. My show is an expose. 2012. There was a picture floating around. And I'm offering you this. You didn't ask me this. Uh, but I'm open book, brother. Uh, there was a picture floating around on Facebook of a small child performing fellatio on a grown man. I was called and asked to see if I could find this man. I had just fallen found some twins that were kidnapped and put into sex trafficking. So I took the picture and put it on my Facebook page. Of the man? Of the, the picture of the man and the woman and the little child. Okay. I put it, I put it on, on my Facebook page. The police director and I were almost really in enemies because I had exposed some things on the Memphis Police Department. Next day, I get a call from the head of a te local television station. They said, there's a press conference going on down here. I said, well, you know, they only invite me to no press conference. He said, no, it's about you. I said, about me. And that picture you got on your page. I was called into questioning about that picture that I put on my page to try to save a child. They thought at that point they had me. I was charged with sexual exploitation of a child, especially aggravated. It was three charges because of the picture. I was arrested, $150,000 bond. I told him once, just let me get to a phone. I paid the bond and got out. I was indicted the next year. They had no reason to hold me because thousands of people had seen the picture. So they offered me a plea deal. That is, we're going to let, let you go. You ain't going to have to do no time or nothing at that. But this is what my lawyer, and I went and got Steve Faris. Steve Faris is the same attorney. I don't know whether you remember the white nurse that shot a preacher husband in the bed and he got her off. Yeah. Well, well, that's who I hired. And um, the deal that they offered me was no jail time, but I had to register as a sexual offender. I told my lawyer, I said, go back in there and tell him I said, fool, shit. I'm not going to sign on to that. I went to court the following year. And it's got to be 20, 13, the latter part of 13. Yeah. And the judge, which was a black man, could see that they were trying to do everything they could to railroad me. And he said over the bench, 
everybody will be treated fairly in, in my court, even Thaddeus Matthews. I said, even Thaddeus Matthews. But all those charges were dropped. They got me with tampering with evidence. I don't know to this day what evidence, but after over $100,000 in legal fees, uh, okay, they gave me probation. So I just threw that in for uh, just keep you there. As far as 2022 is, young lady, I used to screw years ago. I put her in the business. I paid her bills until she thought she was as big as her as me, and her her name was as big as mine. We had been, we'd had our fallouts and things. We would, we hadn't screwed. Ooh, I know in 20, 10 years. Somebody got to her and said, go after that against my tears. So she came at me. And she came out with this lie that I was. I had raped her year, date raped her years ago. I said, well, goddamn, I was dating, date raping you every day at your house. And I had the pictures to show of us. That didn't wash. So she started on the church. His church ain't for real. I said, well, my church is a Tennessee corporation. It's a 501c3. So she got a bogus, she tried to get a bogus restraining order. It didn't work. The judge saw through it so that I laughed at her on my way out the courtroom. She jumps up and jumps on my back in the courtroom. Uh, I sued her for detriment, detriment of character. Uh, all the criminal charges were dropped. And they were dropped simply. First of all, they had no merit. Second of all, the new DA, when he was elected, election night, him and her dancing together. I thought, oh, no, you can't try me. And uh, you and her, boots and bunnies. So my lawyer got everything dropped. So that's Walla on off the duck's neck or, or whatever it says. What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.